Welcome back to Shale's Place, where I do lifestyle, hobby, and craft videos. If that's something you are also interested in, please subscribe. Today I have a lifestyle video, a disaster, do it yourself, and yes, I did it myself. I wanted to paint the main floor family bathroom in our house because it was a chocolate brown and there's no window in that bathroom, so I wanted to brighten it up with a lighter color. So before I started painting, I used green painter's tape and I taped around all the cabinets and all around the shower. I also gave the ceiling a fresh coat of paint and I like to bring the ceiling paint down just a little bit onto the wall so that when I do the painting I can have a nice, clean, crisp white edge. As you can see in my before photos, I used a lot of green painter's tape. And everything was fine when I started to paint. I was able to put on a lighter color. But the problem started when I took off the green painter's tape from around my mirrored cabinet. It pulled away all of the veneer on the side of the cabinet. This was definitely a disaster do-it-yourself. And I really didn't know how I was going to fix it. I bought two different types of veneer from the hardware store. But neither of them matched the cabinet. And then one day I was shopping at the Dollar Tree and I saw some contact paper that had a design similar to what was on my bathroom cabinet. This contact paper has a sticky back, it's washable and it's often used for lining kitchen shelves and drawers. This brand says quick cover on the front and magic cover on the back. Another great thing about this contact paper is that it already has a grid system marked on the back of it. So I just cut a strip about an inch wide, about the same width as the painter's tape was. And because the contact paper has a sticky back, it was really easy just to stick it onto my cabinet. Now I know it's not a perfect match to the cabinet, but it sure looks better than it did before. Please comment down below if you have any other suggestions for me to help me fix my cabinet and also let me know if you've had any disaster do-it-yourselves and how you fix them. Thanks for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe and come back to Shale's Place soon for another video.